Hello YouTube, welcome back to a new video and today we are going to be talking about five transfers that Middlesbrough FC should sign in the January market. First of all I want to say thank you for the recent support on my recent Middlesbrough video uh, and yeah we're doing another one and let's get into it. So number five, Jordan Jones. With Marcus Brown coming back from injury recently, Neil Warnock is looking to play him up front in that striker position. But Jordan Jones could prove to be a crucial backup winger for the likes of Marcus Brown or Duncan Watmore if we play them on the wings. And he currently plays for Rangers and to my knowledge isn't getting much game time and he is a player who is aging and I'm sure he would like to get more game time than he is at Rangers although Rangers are currently sitting top in the SPFL and maybe he would like to stay there just to lift up some silverware now let's move on. Number four, Alex Mowat. Now, Middlesbrough have a variety of midfielders uh, in the likes of Lewis Wing, George Savile, Paddy McNair can even play in midfield, Johnny Housen, Lewis Wing when he's fully fit. But Alex Mowat is currently 25 and playing at Barnsley. Now, Barnsley are currently near mid-table in the championship and moving to Middlesbrough would be quite a step up for him, for his career but again, as I said before talking about Alex Mowat Middlesbrough have a variety of midfielders and I would think that he would just sit on the bench or the reserves for us. Number three, Ainsley Pears. Now, there's no question that Marcus Bettinelli has had some outrageous games for Middlesbrough and a lot of our poor results have been because of him making poor decisions and outrageous goalkeeping errors and one of the only reasons we get a lot of uh, clean sheets is because our back line is solid and Ainsley Pears is currently doing quite well for Blackburn but there's no question that moving to Blackburn has been quite a step down from the starting spot in Middlesbrough's team now, it is, there are no rumours that Middlesbrough are currently targeting a new goalkeeper, but bringing in a goalkeeper that's done well for us before would definitely be good for the squad depth in Middlesbrough. For example, our backup keepers to Marcus Bettinelli is Stojanovic and Mayas has gone out on loan, so... I don't know when he returns, but Stojanovic isn't up to much, uh, and he's just sitting on the bench. So, moving on. Number two, William Saliba. William Saliba signed for Arsenal for £25 million last season uh, from Ass or St Etienne if you would like to call them that. And ever since he signed for them, he has not had a single game, not even in the reserves. Now, William Saliba would be... I think Middlesbrough would have to loan him in because Middlesbrough do not have the finances to buy a player who costs £25 million. 
unless Arsenal are willing to let him go for very cheap. And William Saliba is currently still young. He's 20 years of age. And yeah, William Saliba could grow at Middlesbrough and get starting 11 game time in the Middlesbrough squad. Number one, Yannick Bellassi. Now, if you've seen our recent video, you'll have seen that Yannick Bellassi is heavily rumoured to be moving to Middlesbrough in the January market. Neil Warnock has said that he is one, uh, one of our prime targets in this market. And yes, it would be a very good signing uh, if he's still got it. Uh, he hasn't played for Everton this season. Also, last season I believe he was out on loan at Spartan Lisbon. And to my knowledge he did quite well there. And moving down to the championship would be quite a step down. But you have to believe that Middlesbrough are promotion contenders this season. And that Yannick Bellassi could certainly improve the potential of our squad moving up to the Premier League this season. And also, he's a very f versatile player. He's got a lot of skill moves in his arsenal. And he is getting on. He's 32 years of age. And if he's wanting to go out with some play time, what better to get promoted with Middlesbrough FC. But yes, guys, that is my top five signings that Middlesbrough should make in this January market. If you did enjoy, hit the thumbs up button. If you want to see more videos like this, drop a comment down below and tell me what you think. Subscribe if you're new. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss a single video. Follow me on Twitter. Follow me on Instagram. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.